So it would appear that we actually beat the first campaign, but I promised you guys that I would at least do a campaign that had um, pyramids in it, because that's actually the most interesting part of the game, in my opinion. So we're going to start with the... You guys just want me to pronounce this just because you want to make fun of me, you fucks. Archiac period. There we go. Let's do that one now. In scattered settlements along the sacred Nile River, powerful chieftains emerge. Leading their people with strength of will and spirit. To tame the wild landscape. And bring forth the bounty of Egypt. Villages grow into prosperous cities. Earthen bricks baked under the desert sun become sacred tombs to forever house the souls of their departed nobles. As the people who live along the Nile still struggle to survive in this harsh environment, a local king named Narmer has risen to power. Though Narmer has dominion over much of this land, full unification of the Twin Kingdoms has yet to be achieved. In commemoration of his accession, Narmer wishes your family to establish and govern a new city at Nekhen. This city will have temples to many of the gods of Egypt and numerous places of entertainment. All right, guys. Okay, I'm putting and knocking it back up to hard because as I said, we couldn't complete the first campaign without knocking it down to normal. Fucking assholes that developed this game, but whatever. Uh, so let's uh, we gotta make some beer, some modest apartments, and a population of 1,000. Here we have developing culture. Beer is a part of the culture. We also now have to deal with multiple gods, so they all get jealous of each other and all kinds of shit. So all you have to do is just manage it. But now that we actually have the proper tools we need to actually, you know make people happy this is not an issue anymore and finally more entertainment and then now law and order so we can get a courthouse to reduce risk of pro uh, crime so now i'm gonna try a little bit harder with my format like my layouts for my fucking houses so uh we're all good with that now so we start with 1000 buckaroos it's a speed up 80 percent yeah let's turn that down to like 50. there's that key for that as i said all right, so how we're we gonna start this one, this city here. So one of the things we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to grow some barley, and I can already see on this map itself that this is not gonna cut it for food. This is gonna serve our food purposes early on, but not later on. We're gonna have to expand to this island because this has more of the Nile bullshit, whatever, to to do that kind of stuff. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a nice kind of layout over here. And we're going to actually have a nice roadblock as well. Nice, thick, and juicy roadblock. And so the reason we do this is because we're going to make a crap ton of houses here. We don't have to make that many. It's really not going to be a big of an issue. Um, I mean, we have a lot of options here. We can kind of go decent like this, do a temple to raw. And like, I don't know, Temple to Bath somewhere else or something. They usually want like one or two like people. Like they, they, they love living next to shrines like this. One, two. Okay, so we'll just do like another one right here. Just like that. And we'll make like a bazaar as well over here. I'm also gonna need to make the fire house and shit. An architect's post. Uh, and we're also gonna make a... Okay, they can start coming in a little bit better. So we need to make, like, three temples, otherwise they're gonna get all mad at each other, so... Because they're assholes. Ra doesn't even need to be there. Ra can be over here. Ra's... Ra's a strong man. Or something. I think he's a man. He's something. And then we just make a shit-ass, like, one right here, just so the stuff over here can be, uh, populated. Architect post right here. And let's make some more housing. Sucks to be whoever lives in those slums. And so, the now the guy who works out this stuff is just gonna go around the bend constantly. And I can also do this. So, eventually it will populate all that. 
And now we gotta start working on the farms. We're gonna start with grain first. Maybe make like, well, we don't need to make barley at all. Let's just focus completely on this stuff. So I'm kind of making a nice layout for this stuff. Uh, maybe we'll do, maybe we'll, maybe we'll just make this a little bit better. Well, here's maybe what we'll do, we'll do something like this. Fuck, you need to leave. Fuck. I hate trees. Why can't we just get rid of trees on the planet? So we make roadblocks just so that they don't constantly go into here and like fuck up our feng shui. Whoops. Well, there goes the feng shui. And I will do some more grain here. We're just trying to fit as many as we can here. Uh, which looks like it's easier said than done. But that's fine because we'll just make another awkward looking road. Right here. Because they'll, they'll just go to it. It's fine. Holy shit, this is going to be like the worst thing ever. Oh my god. What will people on the internet think if I have the road looking like that? Alright, that's much better. Alright. There we go. And we'll just put like one more right there. And then this last one. As I said, we'll still do grain here. We'll focus on the island efforts a little bit after. See, we can actually... Oh, wait, we can squeeze them like that. Oh, yeah. That's, that's actually perfect. Fuck, we actually have to leave like this. It's really weird. Uh, but that's fine. So this is this is absolutely flawless and 100% efficient. And don't let anyone tell you otherwise. And apparently now we have desirability issues. I couldn't imagine why, so we're just gonna make a shit ton of gardens here. For these poor ass houses. And then they're gonna be fine now. Okay, now he's complaining about water. So if you actually watch the water guy, let's go see. I didn't actually like, I didn't do this like in a proper format at all. Okay, so here's the water guy. He's like, oh, hey, I have water. So how far does he go? So he should at least do the loop, which he should do. Yeah, so they do the loop, and that's all that matters, is that they go around in a circle here. And they don't just, like, turn around. So this guy is now kind of going to head back to where he is. He, he only goes so far. Um, but we're, we're pretty good. All right, will someone populate that? Oh, my God, the Temple of the Bass. Bass is going to be so pissed he's going to have my fucking balls. No Bass, please. And we, we have 500 people, but yet they, nobody populates this shit. Assholes. Alright, so looks like we couldn't do anything with the food that we had there. So we already, we practically, it's practically over this game. Uh, but that's fine, we'll make two granaries. I don't think that relative distance from the bazaars really matter. Uh, he will just, he's gonna punish my fucking lack of devotion next year's flood and destroy all farms in his path. What? Dude, I've only been nice to you, Osiris. Seriously, dude. You have, like... Oh, shit, they're both too rough. Fuck. Yo, I'm sorry, dude. Oh, man. He got mad at me. <laughs> Alright, so this is gonna be Temple Square. Because now, now I've realized that I've I fucked up. So, you can see, like, he's very wrathful. Oh, well, there he goes, angry. So, you know, he wants to be the big man, the big god on the street, so, you know, now we gotta make more temples for them. Fucking bast. I thought I had him on, on speed dial. People are annoyed with you because there aren't enough jobs. Well, you know, they can fucking take the jobs off the job wall. Whatever, I just, I made another fucking workplace here. I, I, as I said, I'm, I'm not entirely efficient with this stuff because I don't care. But you know what? It's like, it's one of those things. Oh, you know what we can do now? We can actually go make a, a water crossing now, ferry landing. Here we are. So we can go over here. So with this, we actually do need to have um, some places here for someone to live. And we also need to have, okay, I'm not even gonna bother to make any farms, by the way, for this, because he's just gonna destroy them next like year. So I'm gonna be mad about that. I'm already, I'm already planning out ahead and I'm going to be mad about that, so. Uh, let's make some more granaries while we're at it. Make like two more or something. This is like granary central. So how are we doing right now for unemployment? Holy shit, that's a lot of unemployed people. Wow, they're going to have my head. But don't worry, we have, we're going to make pottery and, and all kinds of stuff. So here's, here's going to be Harry Potter. And two potteries here. Is this like... 
Is this far enough? Like, like I don't understand why that's close enough to be populated, but my other stuff isn't. Whatever. Actually, no, don't do not do that here. You go right here. That's why I make, like, a little, as I said, I make a little slum. That's how I, that's how I roll. But I'm just going to make, like, this random shit that nobody's going to work at. Oh, dude, we need the bandstands and shit. I forgot about that. Fuck, there's a house in the way here. That's fine. You know what? You know what? We're, we're fine. Because what I'm going to do is we now have uh, a conservatory. Um, and we have a bandstand, so we can do that. And then we can make a conservatory here, which is, like, something where they play instruments or something. And a juggling school. That will definitely solve the people's happiness problems of 145 unemployed people. Can you imagine that? You know, you just get, like, fucking... That would be the best solution ever. Okay, you know what? We need, we're going to need to quench crime. I'm thinking ahead here right now. And I, I think that people are, are pretty mad at me already, so... Let's just deal with that, and let's make a couple breweries. Maybe, like, two. Uh, actually, we need a storage yard, so... Shit, get, this, get these trees out of the way. They're only hampering us. And it looks like the... the fucking... No this stuff is done. Accept these goods. That's okay. I can use the rest. So, we're gonna see something really dark in just a second. He's gonna get consumed by the Nile. So, you know... I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure this is historically accurate. Uh, is there a limit to pottery and shit that you can put in? No, that, that wasn't until the next game. Yeah, so there's like there's like three ma like series of these kinds of city building games. See, like they're consumed by the Nile. Anyways, um, there's three kind of series of this. And so the first series is um, Caesar, then this Pharaoh and Cleopatra, and then there's the... Um, the one that's like all, mo like, monolithic, whatever, paleontology shit, or whatever the fuck it is. I forgot what it's called. It's a mythology one. That one is pretty baller. Oh shit, dude, we need we need physicians and stuff. Is this actually road access? I can guarantee you it's not. Yeah, it's totally not road access, fuck. Alright, we need to, we need to, we need to remove your house and we're paving it for our space highway. Thanks. Um, and we can make it a puck there here. So people don't really want to live in my city, uh, mostly because it's garbage, but part of the problem is the fact that there's unemployed, like, there's, people don't live in these places, so I'm just gonna, like, destroy some of them. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna also make a juggler school right here, because nobody t tells me what to do. There we go. Alright, so they were a bunch of assholes and destroyed all my fucking farms. That's fine, because you know what we're also going to do? We're going to make fucking barley farms. So, obviously what the game was teaching me is that I need to make barley. Now we just have to remake all this, and it costs fucking money, so we're mad. Well, we're supposed to be mad about it, but... Not, not literally angry. Uh, so we're going to go here, and now we're going to make a couple farms over here. We are so running out of money, though. Holy shit. I do not, I am not very fiscally efficient with anything, let me tell you. Dude, if, if you want me to, if you lend me money, you will never see it again. I'm just saying, ever in your life. But we're gonna make a shit ton of grain here. I don't know how much we really need here, but we're just gonna make a shit ton. Because I like to just make it and then never worry about it ever again. I just assume it takes care of itself, it's magic. So like, does anyone want to live in this city yet? Unemployed, you see like 12 unemployed, so we should be good now. We should have people just flooding into the city. Just want to, would love to live here. Well, we can, we can go see what the people want. Uh, fucking hell, I can't see anything because the fucking text on the top of the screen. We're out of money, but don't worry, we get 5,000 more dollars. Which hopefully will be enough. Uh, oh, we, we also need to say, um, from this one, okay, you know what, this is gonna be just our pottery one. And what we're, gonna, we're, what we're actually gonna do is, we're, from this storage yard, we're gonna say, um, actually, we're gonna just accept none of this. And from this one, we're gonna accept beer and bar barley. No, beer and, sorry, pottery. And this one's gonna accept barley. Because we actually need to have a place where we can accept that shit. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a couple more breweries. 
because that's that's pretty important because honestly and if you have a town that's managed by me you're probably gonna need a couple breweries and we're gonna make a work camp it sounds something sounds like a very bad place but you know it's actually fine this guy needs apparently a water source no apparently he doesn't like being next to the police station who would have thought well then don't be a criminal get out of here I don't allow criminals here in these parts. There you go. See, they're fine with it. Oh, the I just need gardens around everything. Just gonna make some gardens around here. Look, oh look at that. Look at that. all upgrading. And this guy needs food from a local bazaar. So what is she doing? Like, there's only one route she can take. Lack of jobs deters immigration. Dude, they have like tons of jobs. What are they complaining about? See, look, look at this. There, there's jobs, right here. There you go, jobs. And that's 53 unemployed. So, now that this work camp is going, now they're gonna kind of walk up to there. I don't think that they actually go across with this thing, this work camp, so... What we can do is we can just make another work camp here, because this will also solve the problem with the fact that we have high, uh, high unemployment. That's usually how I solve my unemployment issues, is with work camps, because it only costs like 72. That's fine. What does this message say? Population milestone. Okay. Not really a big issue for us. You know, there's just... I, I probably made too much housing, but, you know, that's that's fine. Ordinary cottage. Police station. Okay, they really hate the police. So, we will solve that by removing the police station. Hopefully crime will not go up here. Yeah. We should be... Oh, shit. It's totally going up. What, what do they possibly have to be crimed about? Okay, we're gonna remove this guy. And what we're gonna say is we're gonna say, hey, you know what? Police can be here. And also over here will be... What's that other thing I just made? The pocket theory. Yeah, I don't know I don't know if these slums that I make are, are at risk for disease. It would appear that that's not the case. I don't know why that is, but, you know, I guess they, I guess they just fuck off and die. Because we don't really care. Ordinary Cottage. Rough cottage, uh, ordinary shanty, police station. You know what? Fuck these guys. You know what? No, no, nobody gets to live here. We have, we already have too many people as it is. People are indifferent to me. Well, what are they complaining about? Shit! I want to click on you. Fuck. Well, the city could be a lot worse. As a boss. Well, that's positive. They're not hiring anymore. <laughs> I've been kicked out of my home and through no fault of my own. The city is adequate, guys. Holy shit, look at that barley. Fuck you, man. Okay, dude, we need more beer, I think. Okay, apparently I, I, I may have overdone it with like the creation of barley. I think we won't I think we'll have plenty of beer, but we won't have any of like food. But that's fine, you know what? Cause what's really important in life? Is it beer or is it? Not beer. Alright, so they're upgrading that. There we go, here we go, look at that. We have an ordinary cottage, or no. This is a modest apartment. Isn't that what we're making? We have ten modest apartments, so... Apparently we don't even need- oh, actually I think they have beer, don't they? Uh, yeah, they have beer already. So, the beer is required to upgrade to the next one, and hey, look at this, we're already done. Fuck yeah. Well done. Thanks to your capable leadership, Egyptian civilization has advanced considerably and will continue to do so in the coming decades. Wait, why does it say normal? Least difficult level, normal. What the fuck? What the fuck? Did I, did I fuck this up? No, it's on hard. After a lengthy Whatever, you'll see us, you'll see us shit tomorrow. Has managed to unite no, no, we're done. We're done. No, you're just fucking not seeing this. Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Bye. I don't know why it says that. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, it's on hard difficulty. Okay, maybe I misunderstood that. Maybe it was something else. Whatever. Fuck it. Just know I have it set to hard. That's all. I may have misunderstood what that says. I'm just assuming it's on hard and maybe it was a mistake or something. I don't know. Whatever. Fuck. I'm not cheating. I swear to fuck. Why would I do that? It's fucking single player. And I care nothing of what you guys think about me. Okay, care a little bit. Bye.